somebody up because I was up on the second floor and there's a fucking candle burning in one of the rooms. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave. What is up? Dirty Sunny Deeds here to take you guys on another crazy ass adventure. I've got CJ, my boy, standing right here over my shoulder. We've been traveling around today for like five hours uh, trying to get several different locations and haven't had too much luck. As we're riding around, I happen to spot an abandoned motel. Just sitting on the side of the road. We are in the state of Pennsylvania. Can't wait to get over on that side there, but so we are going to actually take a look to see what is inside. Um, don't know anything other than we were riding by and spotted this place coming from the road and figured it would be a uh, good place to just check out. So we're going to take a walk and see what we can find. Um, this place is, as we look, has been totally destroyed. This is just mounds of shattered glass that is right here. This place, the windows have been broken out. And you can see just extremely, extremely dangerous to actually be walking around here. And this looks like we're coming in the entrance right there. Dude, look at all the broken glass. It's just mounds of glass out there. But this place has been, the drywall has been ripped down off the ceiling. Here's the front desk. CJ, you want a room? Hi, welcome to Days In. How may I help you? How may you help me? <laughs> Would you like a king or a, a double? Um, I tell you what, I'm kind of big. Give me a king size. Okay. Uh, yeah, but could it be in another building? Dude. What? Chocolate chip cookies. Yo, those are fresh. Oh shit, there's all kinds of food over here. Is there? Is there? Okay, one thing I want to let you guys know, um, when you watch these videos, it is extremely dangerous uh, to go into places like this. We have no idea what we're going to run into um, on whether people are actually living here or whatnot. But uh, I'm going to spin it around here and I'm going to show you. CJ, look on the wall. What? Is oh, that a pentagram? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. So we've got a pentagram and hail. Hail Satan. Oh, that's Satan lovely. on the wall. So, <laughs> hey, pray for us, guys. We might not make it out of here. But, yeah, dude, that's uh, honestly the last thing I wanted to see on the wall. Yeah, like, really, really. <laughs> really make me feel so, we're going to. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start. Uh, you can see outside here that there is a hole. Oh, shit, you scared me. A <laughs> uh, whole nother side over there. That this place is just. Oh, it's crazy. Nightfall. Okay. Anybody read that book? Okay, so this is just a hole busted in the wall here. This isn't even actually a doorway. It looks like uh, they've just torn the drywall off and the actual Look at this place, it's just totally. We're in room 1221. It just amazes me that uh, when we come across these places like this and you see and you find the mattresses and stuff like that still on the floors, like, whoa, they just left everything. Of course, I don't know if I'd want a mattress from a motel anyway, if you know what I mean. But uh, it's just 
There's kids' toys. All kind of books and papers. What's up? What is it? Where? In that room, there's a person. Where? Dude, I'm gonna chase you right now. Straight across. Oh, see, there's like a homeless person shopping cart right down there. You see that? Yeah. There's obviously somebody here. I hope so. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> CJ, there's two of us, and one of them will kick their ass. Really? I'm going to go over there. Are you? Yeah. Are you going to explore this building? Yeah, I'm just going to take a quick walk through and look upstairs. All right, and then we'll swap. Yeah. I'll go check that out. You go check that one out. Holler. Holler. I'm going to scream. Okay. <laughs> Right, guys so we're going to go ahead and split cj is going to go check out the other building um if we hear him holler we're going to take off running because uh, that means he's into something but i just want to take a quick walk through this one while we're in here um and show you guys again that this place and this is i don't know why someone would come in and just totally destroy the inside but this is the problem that we run into with some of these locations and and people don't want you to film out or they're so secured because people just come in and just totally destroy the place for no absolutely no reason no reason whatsoever some like cable hookups or something broken mirrors all on the floor So, I'm going to continue on here. I'm going to try to show you guys uh, as much as I can, but um, I don't really think there's any need to go in each and every room because um, they're all pretty much the same thing. Just some leftover bedroom furniture and some mattresses. And this was a no smoking room, so no smoking in here. Yeah, so we'll just continue on through here, and there is. Oh shit. Okay, I didn't know that there was a downstairs. I thought that we were on the uh, upper level, or the ground level we came in off of the street okay <clears throat> let's see <clears throat> TV Okay, there's a back door. Soap dispenser, trash bags. old telephone they don't make them like that no more guys holy shit I think I am down in the basement
I used ivory soap. What is that? Galaxy. Atmosphere. Oxygen. Okay, I don't know what that was, but... trying to make my way through here and not step on anything that's going to go through my shoe into my foot. It's a back door there. All right, so I'm going to uh Go ahead and make my way and go upstairs and just take a quick walk and then I'm going to go see if I can find CJ. Um, creepy place guys. Okay I was going to take you guys upstairs um, to show you around but I just found a huge room at the end of the hallway and I uh, just wanted to give you a quick peek at that. That is a big mirror. Just a mirror in this room that goes the full length. And that's me, Fist Bump Deedsters. I don't know what that symbol is right there. Guys, if you know, uh, if you know what that means, comment below because I have no idea. Um, CJ's over on the other side. I can see him walking around there, but it's a telephone. better than you. Rooms for a heater. Why would that be written on the inside of the wall? Because you know drywall normally covers that. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, now, so I'm going to go ahead and find the stairs and take you guys upstairs, and then we're going to go ahead and uh, head over to the next building. All right, guys, so I have found uh, the steps to go upstairs. There's a broken toilet. Boy, I tell you, I'm making so much noise, but there's just so much stuff that's on the ground that you can't avoid it. Got some Yingling Premium, all right. Now it's a party. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and start upstairs so I can go ahead and uh, get out of this, this side and go over to the other building. We pretty much holy shit. This must have been like a storage area because as you come over here, there's steps to go up to an attic. Just forget it. I already beat you to it. Well, all right, guy. Oh, this is narrow. I can't even. Um, 
this is narrow guys I can't even fit up in between here unless I turn sideways but I don't want to brush up against this stuff because there's insulation and stuff everywhere okay we'll have to send CJ up here because he's a little more aerodynamic than I am and he can climb in them small race cars he can fit up there all right so again it looks pretty much all the same pair of shorts um, so this is going to be uh, just a real quick walk through because I don't want to keep showing you guys the same stuff over and over but uh, yeah rooms are pretty much all the same but I just can't Irma Hello? Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and leave because I don't know if you guys seen it, but there was a candle burning in that room. So that means that somebody is in there or has been in fairly recently. So, all right, I'm walking out now. I'm going to go over and uh, see if I can catch up with CJ. Dot guys walking around the end of that building. Stuff thrown out of here. Dude, there's a basement and there is somebody up because I was up on the second floor and there's a fucking candle burning in one of the rooms. Dude, no joke. Literally, like, you can put this in there, but like, legit, that cart right there has burritos in it. Fresh. What the hell was that? That was a gunshot. That's, yeah, that carton of milk right there just expired in June something, 2018. Yeah, so I would say somebody's uh Dude, somebody is legit living. Right yeah. All right guys, so uh I actually come over here to meet up with CJ and uh he's actually apparently we've got some uh possible homeless people that uh, are staying over here in this section. Um he's seen a couple people and whatnot, so um it's awful loud there. We're going to go ahead and uh, take off because uh, we really don't know where we're at and uh, we don't want to get caught up in anything uh, that we can't escape from. Um, so we're going to go ahead and, uh, and end this video. Um, hope you guys... Uh, uh, enjoyed the the adventure going through the uh, old abandoned motel which turns out it might not be so abandoned um, just showing you guys the back side here I wish we could get up there dude yeah no okay so so. All right, guys. Well, that's I've had enough then. <laughs> All right, so that's going to do it for this stop uh, in our little road trip uh, today. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the content. Uh, 
seeing actually the inside again we just spotted this place uh, as we were riding by um, I believe uh, did you say the name of the motel yeah, they did. okay um, had some uh, actually uh, brochures and stuff on the floor this is was a days in at one point um, but uh, yeah so we've got uh, totally destroyed people living here and we're not gonna bother them anymore uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, pack up so thank you guys for watching and please don't forget drop an elbow on that like button it is so important um, to hit that like button and uh, we'll see you guys again real soon